Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs are for sale by owner. I'm about 15 minutes south of downtown Louisville, Kentucky to do a walk around on this beautiful, fully loaded 2018 Forest River Flagstaff 832BH Classic Superlight Quad Slide Bunkhouse Travel Trailer. Overall length, exterior length is going to be right at 36 feet and the exterior height to the dual AC units is going to be right at 11 feet 4 inches and the unloaded vehicle weight when it came off the assembly line there's a little sticker on the outside that I checked and yeah there's another one right here there we go and uh, the dry weight when it came off the assembly line 8,437 pounds perfect for a heavy half ton and this is pretty much a four seasons camper does have heated uh, underbelly fully enclosed heated underbelly you are going to hear a chirping sound uh, that's the carbon monoxide detector beeping because the batteries are low the owner does know the batteries are down and he's actually gonna uh, get a new battery so this trailer will have a brand new battery all right let's go ahead and get started this is a quad slide trailer start off with the first slide out super slide in the living room and it's going to accommodate the sleeper ultra leather or leatherette sleeper sofa uh, high to bed sleeper sofa and this folds out and you can sleep uh, too comfortably on this and all the fabrics inside and out uh, inside and the condition on the outside uh, I, it, other than the fact that it's dirty uh, I would put this up against any 2018-19 model all day long uh, the color of the ultra leather is going to be like a looks to be maybe a gray beautiful stitching and this is actually very good quality boot dinette also has the ultra leather finish and there is no wear this table actually pretty unique concept that Flagstaff has done with this table this uh, kind of accordions down and rest on this lip here and you can sleep too comfortably on this show off the condition and this is actually cloth on top here looks to be maybe some grays and maybe some silvers and well, I've got good lighting here on the window treatment kind of show that off you do have day night shades all throughout And paint around here. This is going to be your entertainment center. 30-inch uh, flat screen, I think. And it's a Toshiba. And I do believe the TVs were upgraded. And uh, sound bar, I think, was upgraded too. And this is the Bluetooth stereo. It's got all the good stuff. Actually has a DVD player. Huh. Usually they don't have those. But uh, 2018, I think they were getting ready to stop doing the DVD and CD players. But this does have that. And you do have USB and all the connection devices for smart devices this could be your monitor panel here i'm going to show that when we get ready to go outside but just so i don't forget this does have the wi-fi booster go back into the master bedroom here this is going to be a significant upgrade the mattress is going to be uh, the sleep number mattress the owners did not like the original mattress and if you know about anything about trailer mattresses uh yeah they just did not like it they actually spent about sixteen hundred dollars on this sleep number mattress and you do have storage up underneath and that's your aluminum framing which is all integrated in the floor and side walls on your flagstaffs i love these flagstaffs uh they're actually one of my favorite trailers so and again while i've got good lighting it's kind of an oak finish on your cabinet drawer fronts and your cabinet drawer fronts are uh, solid wood drawer fronts looks to be brushed nickel finish and you do have that big window in the front usb charging 110 outlet and you do have a 110 outlet on the other side of the bed and this is part of your uh, sleep number setup and paint around here Toshiba TV and I do believe these were upgrades from the factory glass enclosed shower and you do have skylight
medicine cabinet, not just a mirror. And nice solid wood pocket door from the bathroom into the bedroom. A lot of manufacturers won't do that. They'll do some kind of a cheap accordion thing. Fantastic vent fan. They don't give those away. This pretty much has all the features I can tell uh, that they probably offered in 2018 on this uh, Flagstaff. And you do have dual AC units. And I do believe they're the 15,000, large 15,000 BTU. And they do have the quick dump feature. So once you get to the campsite, open these louvers up, do a quick dump, and a couple minutes later, shut these off. And you've got ducted AC all throughout. Definitely nice. Island kitchen floor plan. I do love this. And these are solid surface countertops. This is not an entry level uh, bunkhouse trailer. This will, I'll be, I probably would definitely consider this a, a, a luxury bunkhouse trailer. Yeah, you don't see uh, solid surface countertops on a bunkhouse trailer usually. Full extension metal ball bearing drawer guides. Looks like a, yeah, looks to be 50 50 undermounted sink, stainless steel. The owners have not had a chance to detail it. Kind of put a rush on this. Uh, I want to get this stuff listed before uh, the season starts up so it's it's a little dirty but it should clean up like a new penny this is going to be the actually the third slide out because in the bedroom is going to be the second slide out and i'll try to go back and show that that's the closet slide out in the bedroom kind of getting ahead of myself but this is going to be your third slide out 22 inch oven largest that they offered in 2018 three burner gas cooktop front burner usually a high output for boiling water that is that is a tall backsplash wow yeah that is definitely well done microwave when we do have the readout working i always like to show that and you do have the eight cubic foot dometic refrigerator turn it on a couple hours later you're ready to go it's gas and electric Oh, huge pantry for this floor plan too. Nice auto light in the pantry. Definitely nice. Thermostat controls right here. And you do have uh, ducted heating and uh, your furnace is gonna be about, I think a 35,000 BTU furnace. Okay. And the bunkhouse room is gonna be the fourth slide out accommodates the ultra leather theater I'm sorry ultra leather sleeper sofa and that folds out and sleeps too and this is your teddy bear mattress up top here uh, and if you want to stow this away in the daytime have access to your TV so you can do some gaming there you go so this coach is equipped with three TVs let's close this lots of room in this bunkhouse room and you do have another teddy bear mattress up here it looks like you could definitely sleep two up here too so one two three four i would say one up here so you got five and then six seven on the booth dinette eight nine ten eleven so this sleeps about eleven people comfortably Huh. definitely nice and you do have 110 outlets in the bunkhouse area and you do have stereo it's got DVD USB and not sure what size TV that is uh, this coach is winterized right now this is uh, where you go to winterize it that's your water heater six gallon water heater this is your service panel here so that's why that panel is off let's put this up help out the owners when they go to button this trailer up after I leave there we go and you do have a looks to be yeah it's a just a skylight up there or I'm sorry a vent that opens up okay on your flooring it's going to be the residential grade uh, 
vinyl flooring and it's the wood plank look and you do have carpet on the slide outs and there's no sign of wear it just needs to be vacuumed all right on your central command here this is all uh, going to be uh, you can actually get an app that connects to your phone and you can uh, operate all this stuff that you can operate here on your phone uh, you have access to your levels uh, looks like uh, I don't have my glasses on all the lights here up top here well, it looks like you do have a uh, you do have a gas electric water heater six gallon gas electric whether you're boondocking or hooked up to shore power kick it on 15 minutes later you've got hot water and there's your LP switch for your water heater water pump switch tank heaters that's a big deal hit the tank heaters and you've got 12 volt heat pads on your holding tank so you can go into colder weather uh, I don't think necessarily like below zero I'm not sure what this is rated at but uh, you can go into colder weather with this camper and sleep light I'm not sure what that is aisle light let's turn all these on an awning retract button and if you did have a second awning you have an option for that slide button three slide button two slide button one and it, uh, okay and there's a fourth slide out button and that's your uh, Wi-Fi booster turn it on boost the signal looks like light switches here we've seen this this is that second slide out and it's the closet so yeah definitely lots of storage look at that it's, it's hanging there we go all right let's speed this video up kind of go outside one last look great floor plan and you do have storage up underneath the boot dinette there is a ton of stuff on these flagstaffs these classic super lights all right it does have the step above system if you watch my videos those are the ones you want nice clean look when you fold them up into the door when you're in transport and they're heavy duty love them should have done that a long time ago huge 20 foot power awning your led lights are all inside the wall right up there that's where they should be not inside the tube so if you got the slide out or i'm sorry the awning in you still have patio lights that's that gel coat fiberglass finish painted fiberglass gel coat front cap that beautiful windshield nice flagstaff badge there classic super light all the decals are in excellent condition and now for one reason uh, the decals are in pretty much excellent condition for 2018 because the owners have always kept it under storage when not in use very important slam latch baggage doors look at the magnets love it and this is up underneath that uh, that bed and there's your aluminum framing auto level right here and if you don't know how to operate it just read the directions here look at that slam latch baggage doors gotta love them and there's your auto leveling enclosed heated underbelly there's some low point drains right there yeah what you want frameless tinted windows probably an 80 percent tint and again your decals look look at the little points excellent condition i would put this up a brand up against a brand new one all day long it's dirty just needs to be cleaned uh the, these some of these uh storage areas they get dusty because of the gravel lots but you could put the tv out here if you want 110 hookups here looks like cable probably cable hookup right there let's back up a little bit outside speakers again the decals I just look at the tips see for any look for any uh, bleaching or curling or anything this trailer has been extremely well maintained awning in excellent condition huge 20-foot power awning aluminum alloy wheels nitro filled gotta let the owners know they need a little bit of air and those are 16s yeah and you do have the tor torsion flex uh, axles, torque flex, I forgot what they call them, but it's basically rides like an independent suspension. And there's, your, see, there's some of your stabilizer jacks or leveling jacks. Yeah. There's an LP line hookup right there. 
and another one right there two lp gas hookups in your outside kitchen area which is nice huge dorm style fridge this is going to be three times as, as big as the usual ones they put in here and this is your two burner gas cooktop looks like it's never been used let's see what we can do we're one handed here let's try to close this up yeah I think we can yeah that automatically goes in and this is aluminum uh, they're not wood so if it gets wet you don't have to worry about it rotten definitely nice nice outside light let's turn that off yeah oh slim latch baggage doors too on that garage or kitchen area nice okay swing out grill arm on the trunk or on the bumper here see it's dusty it's just dirty just dusty really nice wash job again should clean up like a new penny uh, again frameless windows you are prepped for backup camera you do have a ladder to get up on your roof I checked your roof all the lap sealant everything is good to go service light here cable hookups here this is going to be your uh, potable water fill which is uh, I believe uh, 40 45 gallon 43 gallon, 43 gallon freshwater tank this is nice this is going to be where you winterize and look they give you a little service light and they give you a switch for your pump so you've got a pump inside turn on your water pump and you got one outside here this is motorhome features you guys look follow directions to winterize let's turn that off there we go spare tire and cover they don't give those away all right i'm gonna have to go around the other side because get a little tight here let's uh, show off that gel coat i did check this coach for or trailer for water damage did not find any issues passed with flying colors 240 pound lp tanks with cover they don't give those away uh front power jack the owners do have a blue ox hitch they're not letting it go with the camper because they paid a good penny probably a around a thousand dollars for the hitching it's the weight distribution sway control hitching but if you're interested in it maybe you can work something out with the owners the only reason why the owners are selling this trailer is because they're getting a pool an in-ground pool they're going all out uh, on this trailer the only thing it's a non-issue to me the awning was kind of boogered up up against that pole it was just the awning the slide out awning they took the awning off so you've got a full awning package but the awning on the bunkhouse slide out is gone but to me i'm not even worried about those i don't like uh, slide out awnings they're a pain in the ass uh 50 amp service on this coach and you do have a little light to show that you've got power coming in there you go that's where you hook up some of your hookups right there and Let's see here. Let's see if I can get a better look. And again, ladder. Get up on your full walk-on roof. Again, all aluminum frame, construction. There's that, uh, look at that gel coat fiberglass. Even though it's dirty, it still glistens. See? No curling. Yeah, she should clean up real nice. All right, let's see if we can get a little bit better okay well I can't get up underneath there without breaking my back because I've got the camera but that's your hookups for your sewage and again your tires uh, tires are in excellent condition uh, the owners uh, they believe it has about 2,000 miles on the tires and again that's pass through storage up underneath the bed Slam latch baggage doors, gotta love them. There we go. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's some hookups here. And there's your enclosed heated underbelly. Okay. I know I didn't get everything. These uh, flagstaffs are, are pretty much fully loaded. Anyway, if you want to come and see the coach, the trailer, just call the number on the ad. You always deal directly with the owner. And if you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. And if you want to keep up to date on RVs and trailers coming for sale by owner in the Louisville, Kentucky area, you can always follow HelpSellMyRV.com on Facebook, Twitter, 
and YouTube.